guys, welcome back to the Maybelline Makeup Loft. Today I am creating a really exciting look. So basically today I will be recreating the Bachelorette's rose ceremony look from tonight's episode. But anyway, before we get into it, don't forget to thumbs up the video, comment down below and subscribe to the Maybelline channel so you guys are updated every time we upload new videos. And if you want to learn how to get this beautiful look, just keep watching. Okay, so starting off makeup free, we're going to start off with eyebrows. I'm going to use my Total Temptations Brow Definer and this one is in the color Deep Brown and like the name suggests I'm just going to define my eyebrows a little bit more and give them a little bit more structure. After I've done that I am going to clean up my eyebrows with a little bit of my Age Rewind Concealer just to get a really nice crisp line. I'm now taking my Brow Precise Fiber Filler and this will hold my brows in place but also make them look a little bit more fluffy and hairy, as weird as that sounds, it just makes them look a little bit more natural. Going back in with my Age Rewind Concealer, I'm going to use this to prime my eyelids for my eyeshadow today. After I've whacked that concealer on, I'm just going to blend it out with a sponge and then I am going to set that base down with my Fit Me powder just so I get a really nice smooth clean canvas. Now I'm going to take the beautiful The Burgundy Bar palette and I'm going to start off with that light brown. This eye look is pretty simple but really beautiful. I'm going to just blend this back and forth into the crease. And for the lid, I'm going to take this really light shimmery champagne shade and just put this pretty much on the lid, like I said, and also the inner corner. Now taking this white shimmery color, I'm going to put this on the brow bone. So for my eyeliner today, I am using the Master Liner, but I did take it onto my brush because it is such a creamy product. And I just wanted to use it on a brush so I could smudge it out. The eyeliner is not too crazy today. We're just doing the waterline and like on the top of the lash line. And now I'm taking the dark brown in the Burgundy Bar Palette and I'm just going to smudge that out a little bit more. So before I go in with mascara, I'm just going to quickly curl my lashes and I like to pulsate the kind of curler so it really curls them well. And taking my Big Shot mascara, this is one of my favorites, I'm just going to coat my lashes. I also did add falsies, this is totally optional, but I do have quite small eyes so I wanted to accentuate them a little bit more. So for my face makeup, I'm going to start off with the Master Prime. This one is the pore filling one, just because I got really, really large pores. I'm just going to put this all over my face and I'm also going to use a hydrating one because I really wanted that luminous hydrated look. For foundation today I'm going to use my Dream Satin Liquid. This one's in the color True Beige because I had a good fake tan on so I needed something a little bit darker to match um, the rest of my body but love this foundation. It gives such a beautiful glow. It's not full coverage but it's just the right amount. It's a good medium coverage. Going back in with my trusty Age Rewind Concealer again, I'm going to put this underneath the eyes. I'm also going to put it on the sides of the nose to slim down my nose, around my nose, on the chin and also on the forehead. And then I'm just going to blend that all out. I really love this concealer. It's good coverage and it brightens and cancels out that redness on my face and around my nose. I'm going to go back in with my Fit Me powder and this one's in the color Ivory just to really brighten up that under eye. And to set the rest of my face I'm going to use my Superstay powder and this one's in the color Nude. So next I'm going to take my Master Contour Palette just to bring a bit of shape back to my face and I went a little bit heavy handed so I went back in with my face powder and just blended it out. So I'm pretty much just sculpting out my face around my cheekbones, a little bit of my nose, around my jawline. I'm also going to use the blush out of this palette. I love this blush so much. It gives such a beautiful glow to the face. To intensify that glow, I'm going to use my Master Chrome Highlighter. This one's in Molten Gold, and I'm going to use this on the tops of my cheekbones, my cupid's bow, my nose, and also my inner corners of my eyes. I'm just going to finish off with some mascara, and now we're going to move on to lips. And for my lips today, I'm going to use the Superstay Matte Ink Lip, and this one is in the color Dreamer. 
And last but not least, to be a little bit extra, I'm also going to use that highlighter on the tops of my shoulders and also my collarbone. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did making this video and hopefully I'll see you guys really soon. Bye!